What's going on, CTI fam? Today, we have a little video for you. It is the unlawful arrest of Michigan Constitutional Crusader and Spanky Pants. Uh, they were in Mount Carmel, Illinois, just exercising their rights on a public sidewalk. When some people at a bank had a problem, uh, people all over the town were calling into the police department, making false reports. Uh, so much uh, unlawful tyranny going on in that uh, little town of uh, Mount Carmel. So... Um, this is part of the video. If you guys want to see the full video, make sure you go over to their channel and uh, make sure you tell them that CTI sent you. Uh, so we're going to get into the video and make sure you guys smash that subscribe button. I appreciate each and every one of you. Let's get into the video. Out there. Mount Carmel Police, this is Shelby. Uh, yes, Shelby, this is Brandon Hodson with DHI Realty. And there are a couple of gentlemen I just wanted you to be aware of that are walking up and down Main Street videotaping people, and they are shining the cameras into, like, our office. And uh, actually, I think one of your officers just pulled up. Yes. They were do you recognize them back here? The I do not. They, okay. they, I asked them if I could help them, and they said, well, can you give me $100? Uh, and I said, well, no, I don't believe so. And he said, uh, he said no. Hi. Hey, can I ask what you're doing? May I ask what you're doing? Yeah. You can't help me, and you videotaped me the whole time. Interesting. Um, and, okay. and then he just gave the officers a figure as they drove by outside. Um, there's two gentlemen, both of them, taping and videotaping. I just thought you guys would want to be aware. Excuse me. Did you fart? Did you fart? Oh, okay. Okay. Yep, we already have a call on them. Uh, thank you for the background. I appreciate it. Yep, no problem. You have a great day. You too. Bye. Uh, bye. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he's going to follow us. Yeah, he's going to follow us. No, he ain't. He's going to think twice about it. Nope, nope. He's in the costume. He does. I would agree. Yeah. And he keeps farting. Oh, he's a supervisor, is he? Yeah, sturgeon. They're all a little fishy, but... Hey, everybody, what's a thrill? What'd he say? Well, look I, them all out down there. I could have swore he said you're not free to go. You're detained, you're not free to go. There's somebody got a lawnmower on the sidewalk. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> Damn, the crazies came out today. Yeah. Wow, holy smokes. I gotta get away from this damn music, dude. It's yeah. killing me, right here. I'm crossing here, dude. This is Brenda. Brenda, you need to go on a hard lockdown. This is the Mount Carmel Police Department. We have officers yeah. heading that way still. Do you see them yet? Yes, yeah, they're here and they're, and they're a Okay. Okay. Thank, Thank you. you. Bye. Man, 
Man, they jamming the hell out that music in this town. That's the only thing they got going for them is their radio station. Uh-oh, she's coming out. Yep. Heck yeah, man. That's awesome. Can you just look at the little buildings or what? Wait, cool. You're going to answer our questions. If not, I will call the police. Yeah. Oh, they're over there. Well, I will call them over here. Oh, you can do whatever you like. Well, you're considered. Feel free to waste tax dollars. Yeah, absolutely. It's not wasting tax dollars. Sure it is. Protecting our building and no, you're things. protecting your feelings. That's all. You I'm just, not protecting my feelings. Oh, you you're absolutely are. You're, prote all, you're absolutely it's protecting your feelings. The building and I'm <laughs> exactly. Casing it's the hilarious. Building. She's protecting her feelings 100%. No, because y'all don't hurt no, my yeah. feelings. Uh, apparently. Like feelings apparently. What do you mean by people like you? Yeah. Because you're being belligerent. I mean, I belligerent? You, you say nothing. With cameras Dude, and then you tell are you, people, are you like a simple bitch? Tell. Don't. Are you a simple bitch? Simple in the head? Are you simple in the head? I'm going to what? I'm going to what? Oh, yeah. Really? Yeah. yeah. You're the one standing with the camera, <laughs> not stating your purpose, and you're kind of a bang. Hey, I don't have to you know what? A damn word what I'm doing is none of your business, lady. Exactly, and you'll be escorted away. Sounds yeah. good. Yeah, let's see. Go over yeah. and get the cops. Let's see. We are. Okay, cool. Let's see. Jesus. I you're getting the police because yeah. it's like, you know, they're being belligerent. Yeah, I wasn't until you told me I was being belligerent. Not. No, I did it. No, I said I said you're protecting your feelings. I'm sorry you took that as name calling, but you are a simple. My feelings. You absolutely are. Good. I'm glad you think so. Your opinion. You're a C U N T. See you next time. Your opinion of me means nothing. I know. It yours means nothing to me. I don't care. Good. What makes you think I care? Business where I've worked for 27 years, and I can have an opinion of you if I want. I don't really care. And stuff, you look like idiots out here. If you really want to fucking be <laughs> She's really butt hurt. Dan, did you bring your butt hurt cream? She needs a tube. She needs a tube of butt hurt cream. She is extremely butt hurt. She is extremely butt hurt. Yeah, I'm terribly butt hurt. Now, I think you're a freaking weirdo because you're standing out. Well, what you think really doesn't matter. Exactly, and what you think of us doesn't matter. I didn't say it did. I'm not on your premises. You are on our property. No, I'm on a public sidewalk, you no, simple you're, bitch. you're holding a camera in front of our bank. In, in front it's of not it. allowed. Not yes, it's it not is. allowed. Says yes, who? Says no, who? it's not. What law is that? It's against our security it policy. Oh, but that's not a law. So that's not a law. Come Here they come. Here they, they come. Good. Don't worry. Good. How much you, how much you want to bet they're going to not remove us? Yeah, I'll bet you $100 to a bucket of shit. Allowed to film a bank. $100 to a bucket of shit. No, you're ignorant. Okay. You're ignorant. Yeah, we'll see. I never claim to be nice, and I don't have to be nice. There you go. There you go. Dipshit sergeant said, lock the bank down. Let's go away from the Shut up. No. Shut up. I don't give a damn. I'm on a public sidewalk. Yes, you are. So go mind your business somewhere else and not mine, bitch. This is my business, not yours. Sergeant J. Jared Price. Price. MC9 for you. Okay. So, this is what's going to happen. What's going to happen is I'm going to keep walking up and down the sidewalk as a free man in America, and you're going to leave me the fuck alone. Well, right now, you're detained. For what? For what? Pull your hand out of your pocket. All right, guys, it is at that moment that they were both arrested. Um, I'm not going to show the arrest. If you guys want to see the full video, the links to their uh, video will be in the description. Um, so, yeah, guys, we did make a visit over to Mount Carmel. Let's see how that goes. All right, CTI fam, we are here in Mount Carmel, Illinois at the uh, City Hall. I am here with uh, Firm Audits, Michigan Constitutional Crusader, and Spanky Pants, uh, we are here gonna get some, uh, try to request body cam footage for uh, their unlawful arrest while they were recording on a public sidewalk. Uh, so yeah, guys, uh, stay tuned with us as we go in here and do so.
I mailed it. The body the work? Family? Yes, I did. If it didn't come in, I mean, that but was Did you mail it after the initial FOIA packet was sent out? Yes, that next morning. Oh, okay, okay. so then it might be on its way. Someone. It might be. Yeah, it is on its way. Oh, okay. It's right. probably in my mailbox. So okay. We, um, um, that other package, I think I mailed it on a Wednesday. We got it. Yeah, yeah, I got it already. Friday, yeah. Friday, and then, did you get it on a, or I mailed it on a Thursday. Tuesday, and then came on a Thursday. Thursday. Yeah. So that's pretty impressive. That, <laughs> I mean, it's not a lot. So the other package right. should be there probably today or tomorrow then. Should, I honestly, I thought with us mailing it, that will mail the Thursday morning. So yeah, right. yeah. the day I got your email, it was your email, correct? Yeah. Okay. So as soon as I, I was on the on the road, uh, the chief of police got it. It was I and I take responsibility for it. It was sitting in there no next to the the disc. So okay. and the disc you got. So yep. I had him mail with us. Hopefully you get there Saturday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I'll tell you what, I, the fact that it, I'm shocked that a package got there that quick. <laughs> 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 Don't underestimate the USPS. They, they, they come through every now and again. Ah, we've lost probably in the last six months close to 3,000 water bills in the last three months. Holy shit. smoke. That's insane. That's why we're trying to get everyone through it online. Must be because it was so big it was hard to lose. <laughs> well, that's pr they probably didn't want it in storage. They probably didn't want it. I mean, that was a heavy concern. So. I, I got yeah. it from the Holy shit. Yeah, it is. That's why. I didn't want to create a drop box for it. So. Right. Yeah. You guys right, should cool. have it. Cool, man. That was all the reason we came. Yeah. No Appreciate problem. you. Yeah. No problem. Right. Have a great day. Good day. Good day. Good day. Easy peasy. Let me she said, oh, you're casing the bank. And we laughed. And she, and then she laughed. She knew yeah. we wasn't casing the fucking bank. <laughs> She's like, you know, right? It's hilarious. That's what she said. Yeah. Like, yeah. So obviously she knew we weren't trying to case the bank. Right, right. If she really thought y'all were a threat, she wouldn't have approached you. She wouldn't have came out because, like I said, the fucking police department called her before we ever got there and yeah. told her to go into lockdown. And she ignored him and came out. Right.